again everyone, this is Beat Back in a 7 with King Piltshard 8's dungeon. In the last part we started everything, now let's continue it. <laughs> okay, so we are with Nameless Slayer looking guy and half, and now we're gonna head on north. Cursor, get out of here you. Jeebus, that thing is huge! I can't go through with you, you go on ahead. I'll look after the little one. Half! Okay, uh, did Half turn into a Pokemon? Okay, I know he was going like, no, I'm not the little guy. No, uh, yeah, he was doing a thing where he was going, my name is Half. For Jeebus Crust's sake. Or uh, something like that. Anyway, this is simple. A uh, little snake train, just. Okay, so he doesn't kill half, that's nice. Ah, an ambush! Don't worry, I've got a plan. Let's hear it! Okay, turn your sword northwest and wait. I'll kill my guards, then I'll get yours. Wait, what? Okay, hold on, my game just got snapped out because of Steam. Let me get back to it. Um, okay, yeah. Ah, uh, Steam, what a jerk. Okay, so let's kill the guards, in fact. I don't believe I need your help with that. Actually, I think that's gonna be like a challenge. Let me just... Turn your sword northeast, okay. Oh, okay. That's better. Please we'll move north. Okay, you come up above me. That was a great plan. Thanks. Yeah, I don't think I need the help of the dude. Not even at all. That went simple. Kill all the guards. Without the slayer. Start challenge in five. Four. Three. Two. One. Go! That shouldn't be too bad. Well, okay, yeah, so there's a little change in the fact that there are no force arrows, but that's hardly a problem for me because these are so easy to kill. With the proper help, guards aren't that bad. Okay, anyway, so that's another challenge completed. You can walk back up the stairs, and let's go north. Okay, you take that path. I'll take this one. <clears throat> Keep mixing up my voices. Anyway, this is the algebra of Ra. Oh, ha ha. To be a successful delver, one must be as clever as they look. So there are spiders too. Great. I like, can't yeah, wait for the part where the spiders disappear for no reason. Oh. Four eight seven. To proceed, one must excel at math. You may pass if you give me the answer to Satan add one dozen. Satan add one dozen. Um. I'm not good with demonic mathematics, sorry. <laughs> um, four, uh, eight, seven. Is that where the four seven happens? Because he's waiting for me to drop like a specific. Satan add one dozen. What mathematic what mathematical value does Satan have?
Oh. Okay. I'm just gonna wait until this crypt trips up for me, I guess. Okay, alright, so I managed it somehow by dropping like these four trapdoors over there. Or five, rather. Okay. What was with those roaches earlier? Okay, four, eight, seven. Okay. You enter a dark house. It is pitch black. You have a match, a candle, and a lamp. Which one do you use first? Um. Well, you need a match to light the candle, so... And a lamp, so a match. Okay, okay, so what do... Okay, I'm supposed to kill these guys. Alright, let's kill them. Okay, no glitches, that's good. Anyway, finally to escape, uh, to escape this room and move on to my next challenge, you must tell me what x in the formula 3x minus 9 equals 0 is. Alright, that's easy. So, in order for this to equal 0, the uh, total value of this needs to equal minus, uh, to, needs to equal 9. So that's three. That's really easy. I mean, that's like basic elemental algebra. I mean, come on. <laughs> oh, great. Okay, to solve this riddle, you must possess a way of words. Try to solve the riddle of the word and pass if you can. Step on your orb, receive ints. Okay. Letters go in order top is A and bottom is Z. Are you sure you know the word? What? Um, my letter is the first in line. Yes, uh, in line. Yes, this rather fine. My letter is in the middle. Quite a riddle, not a muddle. Quite elusive and definitely not easy. This is the last letter there is. Don't disrespect it. It is a diversely difficult letter to discover. Okay, so... My letter is the first in line. Yes, indeed, this is this rather fine. Letter is in the middle, quite a riddle, not a muggle. It's D. It's, uh, there is, don't suspect it. It is... A diversely difficult letter. First is Y. Okay, so they all close the doors. I just kind of need to cheat my way. L. E. D. Yeah, I know. I know. I cheated my way out of that one. <laughs> Is I really gonna bother with these kinds of riddles? Because honestly, I'm not good at them. I, I'm just not good at these riddles. I'm sorry. This, this is merely what it is. Okay, so, um. We must help our friend, I think. So now we're not going back. First place tie. Wow, I'm so great. The plus side, this riddle seems to have been solved for us. Okay. Help me out, Beefro. How'd you get in there? I, I, I don't know. I was doing a great job of cleaning this room. 
when the door closed behind me. Can you help me out here? You weren't doing a good job because those roach queens are on the way and you didn't kill a single one of them. I suspect sabotage. Okay. Alright, let's help you out. Because I'm not going anywhere anyway, so... The game won't progress if I don't help you, so... Seriously, I'm gonna be surprised this guy doesn't turn out to be an evil guy. I mean... He's that one dude that just appears out of nowhere and just seems to be uh, in the know of everything. He always has these perfect ideas to get out of each situation, so clearly that means he must be the villain. <laughs> hey. I'm getting around in life with doubt and not manage to figure sense and lick of these things out. Anyway. The only reason I'm saving this guy is because the game wants me to. No, trust him for a minute. I mean, he's a slayer for flying sake. Even the, even the intro like admitted it. Even the game itself admits he's a slayer, so... Can I even trust him? I mean, I guess that would be like a bit stereotypical to assume that all slayers are, you know, evil, but... I mean... It is a judgment that was made with reason. All the slayers that have been encountered by Bethro have all wanted to kill him, so... It's only fair to have a bit of skepticism, you know? Also, this goblin doesn't count towards the... Uh, towards the door. That makes sense. Think of it as payback for that plan. Okay. Okay, let's go. <clears throat> so I'm just gonna... Um, do the challenge. Gonna be this time you're the slayer. Oh. I don't wanna do that. Okay, come on, come on, come on. Okay. Right? Really? It was the room that he faced like that one? Because if that orb opened that door, then he wasn't stuck. This just makes me more suspicious of him. Because he was never really truly stuck now, was he? No, he wasn't. Could have gotten out at any time. And even then, he didn't even do a great job cleaning up that room. You know? He lied. Who's to say he hasn't lied about other things? Ah. Uh. Yeah. No, I haven't gotten where I am in life by distrusting, uh, by trusting people. Because, well, if I did, then my life would be a lot better. <laughs> uh, horrible, depressing thoughts. Anyway, let's uh, get back to slay on the roaches. So yeah. I don't know. I'm just a little suspicious of the guy. Everything just seems fishy about him. Maybe it's just a plot hole, or it's deliberate. If it isn't, well... That'd be pretty interesting, I have to say. If all those hints were deliberate, then I would have to applaud him for some creative storytelling. Anyway, there's a bunch of goblins. Let's, uh, let's kill them. Let's kill the goblins. Let's kill those uh, green-backed uh, evil doers. I know it's not right to see him badly because of uh, the fact that they're green, but what can I do? That's, that's all they ever do is kill me. Anyway, I saw that. They're not getting it from me. Man. That stupid thing awaits me, I wonder, and I ponder at night. Okay, so this is... Uh, this is a uh, tar, and um, the car's gonna get in the way. Yes, it is.
What? What the heck are you even trying to do, buddy? Um. Okay, that's just weird. Um. Let me try to fix that. Okay. Well, it's better when he's. What? Why doesn't he even try to spin towards the. What an idiot! You can turn, stupid! That gets you through the tar! Oh, wow! Oh, wow! Do I really have to deal with this stupid guy? Can't even do anything right! Why am I suddenly British? That's just... that's just odd. Seriously, you can turn. You want to get to that other spot, just turn. Oh. Oh God, what are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> uh. Come on, man. Get a grip and stop dying. It's my job. I'm the only one who gets to die around here. Oh, would you? Why do you keep doing that? No, stop that. It's weird. People think you're stupid because of that. And they would be wrong. <laughs> God, what an idiot! Anyway, I gotta backtrack now. Be nice if I didn't have to, but... Life ain't fair, you know? Alright, let's get out of here. I just realized how annoying secret finding was gonna, is gonna be with all this. Cause, uh, cause I'm gonna have to actually hunt for secret walls. Okay, take the left platform, I'll take the right. Let's hurry on ahead. Wait, where's Half? Oh, there he is. Come on, no time to waste. As Bithor ascended the stairs, he decided to question his new friend. Why did you really get trapped in here? He asked. I don't know. He replied. I really don't know. Suddenly, they heard a scream from ahead. Come on, let's go. Come on, we have to help them. Whoa, these roaches got pegged. Whoa, those roaches got pegged. Gotta think of a way to get through. That's how. Huh, good luck. Ha. <laughs> But seriously, what's the actual attempt and way of going through there? Secret wall shenanigans? No? Okay, yeah, so it's just a little trick. So half will be able to get through. Resetting system. System reset. Oh, so it's a good old game of guessing. Thankfully for me... I have magic on my side. Suddenly this. This, looks, this just looks like a mishmash. <laughs> I love how that woman's just coming after me like that. Alright, guard, die. Okay, so what, the door opens all the doors? Okay, good. I don't mind. I really hope the challenge isn't kill all the seep, because that's just gonna be tedious instead of challenging.
Whoa, that's a pretty big combo. Okay, what's the challenge? What if there was a serpent instead? Professionals only? Well, I don't know who you think you're talking to, but I'm a very professional professional. Let's do this. You know the rules by now, so I'm off on a short haul in the blonde. So long. Okay, so... Yeah, this is, a. Uh, this shouldn't be too difficult. Just gonna cut out some seed. Really, the only challenge in this room is, uh... None. <laughs> there isn't any. What am I talking about? Well, a few of these things might pose a few problems in the long term. Well, yeah, the brain thing is... And there's a lot of lag. Probably all those seep. Okay, the mud babies are surprisingly difficult to deal with. Challenge! Reduce the lag in this room by, like, 100%. <laughs> okay, so yeah, they've kept me behind for too long. So now I'm kind of short on time. Okay, queens. How about ye? Hey, look, a single spider. But you know what? No, 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 no. I'm not letting these guys live. It's gonna be troublesome in the end. I mean, some might assume that in the end it won't even matter, but these people are just pessimist. Or wrong. Just you know, playing out like wrong. Okay. And so, we have challenge clear. Kill a snake. Let's get out of here. We throw a walk back up the stairs. That wasn't that difficult. What are you talking about? Our plan is going exactly as we desired. Yes. So, we shall be rid of that pesky Delva. Yes. Can you say anything else? No. Who are they? What about King Pillchild? He'll show up soon. This isn't a good place to talk. Let's disguise ourselves. Okay. Let's go. Okay. No, Beethro saw them. Hello. How's it going? You, I will kill you, you fake. Wait, I'm the real one. Oh yeah? What's his name then? Um, Hill? Oh, okay, you're the real ones. Okay, let's go. Wow! Vithro, you saw them transform right before your eyes. How do you do this? How do you do this be so stupid thing? Anyway, this is a, you know, one of those door sandwich rooms. Just like we love them. Um, not. Oh, wait, I forgot this guy. So, two Mimic Potions? Why? I feel like this puzzle might have had more potential if you had to figure out a way to desync your mimic. That would be interesting. Uh, problem? It surely can't be. Can be what? It looks like the Nether. Surely not. The Nether died. You killed him yourself. Yeah, you're probably right. Why is there a picture of the Nether? Oh. Oh, 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 why? This just looks tedious. Ugh. Groan. Sigh. Ugh. 
But anyway, let's kill some goblins. I guess. Man, I should do a good job of killing these four. Oh no, he's getting away. Not. How about I just lure him in there? All of them. Okay, now I'm okay. Yeah, they'll all die soon enough. Somehow. I'll make sure of it. Okay, now he's a tar technician. What the heck? Why is there a tar technician waiting for me? Is he waiting for technicality? A tar technicality? What the heck is a tar technicality? That's just stupid. Jeff, stop being stupid. I don't know why I turned on the room lock. Guess I wanted to feel safe. That would explain a lot. Anyway, uh, let's say kill all of the trapdoors by stepping on them viciously without any ma without any malice. <laughs> yes, I am viciously murdering things without malice. That makes sense. <laughs> oh dear. Okay, he's dead. Alright, so. Hi, be through. Hi, be through. Whoa! What's going on? Two of you? Will one of you get the door? Okay, be through. Okay, be through. Um. Come on, you. Okay. Come on, you. Okay. Why are they doing the same things? Ah, two halves. What in the F is going on? Okay. Which one of you is real? I am. I am. Okay, that didn't quite work. If only there was some way to tell which was which. Well, this trapdoor, doing this trapdoor puzzle will tell me for sure which half it is. Yes, I believe the trapdoor puzzle has such magical properties. But now I could just bump the door. Oh, uh, no, they're both going. I can tell which one is fake. Yeah, it's this one. Ha 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 ha! Yeah, I figured. So, what, is this gonna oust himself like that after trying so hard to not be perceived? What the other, what did the other guy even do anyway? Seriously, where's the other clone? Okay, um... Alright, middle floor. As B3 and Half ascended the stairs, they couldn't help but wondering where the friend was. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. And why have they disguised themselves as his friends? As these dilemmas rushed through Bethro's mind, the door slammed shut behind him. By the look of things, this floor had sustained heavy damage. But for what? Come on, Half. Okay. Yeah, I'm just gonna let you go on ahead. What? <laughs> okay, uh, yeah. So this has been Mithril Back in the 7 with King Pilchard the 8th's dungeon. Join me in the next part where we take on more things, I guess. Yeah. So, I'll see you in the next part. Have a nice one.